after you have clicked on the link uh, below the video download the 64-bit uh, file click on download okay. and the file would be downloaded onto your computer it would be a zip file unzip the uh, DLL file from the zip folder okay this is the zip folder uh, double click on it to open it okay and you can click on extract or and it would sh uh, show you the part where it gets extracted it has been extracted or else the other way is you can drag and drop the file onto your desktop Uh, once extracted uh, you'll have this folder this is the file the DLL file and you need to paste the file in a in a path I'll show you the path As shown uh, in the previous uh, step, uh, click on the file explorer. I'll manually show it if you are using Windows 10, okay? Uh, or if you are using Windows 7, click on start, then click on computer. Basically, we need to go into C drive, okay? Under C, we need to go into Windows. Under Windows, there would be a folder called System32. Here it is, system 32 one which is highlighted. Open that folder and the file which you have extracted in which you'll have a DLL file. Copy the file okay, and paste the file in system 32. Okay, click on continue and it would copy the file and uh, go into syswow64 folder and paste the file again here. Okay, click on continue okay and once this is done uh, please hit restart restart the computer right click restart okay and if you are using windows 7 it's the same start uh, beside shutdown you'll have a small arrow click on it and select restart after the restart the issue get f issue the issue should get fixed and uh, thank you for watching please do not forget to hit subscribe and support me so that i could make more such videos and if you have any doubts or queries please post it below the video thank you